boom live and direct yeah and i don't think it's hard that hard to uh, take people out of this programming also it's not that hard to format that that program but it's to get people to see we don't see we're blind we're completely blind to it everything that's happening in life we're blind to it we have eyes but we don't see we don't see things for the way we look at nature but we don't see we don't feel nature this is the thing we don't feel nature we don't feel nature on a deep uh, profound connection we're just seeing it without sensing it like it's like our senses are completely gone off track and we don't sense things for what they are we don't sense nature we don't sense people we don't sense uh, reality we don't sense nothing it's like they have taken control over our senses and by inculca inculcation uh, brainwashing constant brainwashing schooling and all this come and in induce a program in your head and if you're not wise enough to recognize that program you will be uh, your whole life will be spent into a, a program state so it's up to you you either stay with the program or you create your own program your own uh, I think it's time for humanity to wake up anyway some of us are seeing some of us are seeing the light and keeping the eyes on the light you know keep your eyes on the light don't don't get distracted because that's what baby don't do they don't want us to have our sight on the light and sight on greatness and sight on no no they want us to be distracted constantly distracted with nonsense and something that is fake a reality that is fake so at least if we start recognizing what is fake what is not fake it's a good step forward huh sir what do you think if we start recognizing what's fake and what's not fake if we stop telling lies in society things will change no what do you think i think it's time for humanity to wake up that's what i'm talking about time to wake up to who we are huh some of us are, some of us are seeing the light, some don't, but you speak English, yeah? Oh, you don't speak <laughs> You should have told me, I'm speaking English, tu parles français ou? Tu parles français, oui? Ah, ok, vous parlez français. Non, je disais, c'est temps pour l'humanité de se réveiller, c'est ça que je disais. Pour l'humanité se réveille. Mais c'est pas tout le monde qui... Euh... Not a, if if everyone cared, that's what I would like to see. If everyone would care, what it would like, you know. The, sometimes I tell that to myself. That the only thing is, people, the, we have to bring them to a state of uh, of caring, caring for themselves, caring for humanity, caring for uh, for creating uh, something. Uh, I don't know. Some people just don't care. They just they think you're cuckoo. Uh, they think you're cuckoo. Just talking about reality. Uh, that's how this man made me feel a bit. But he didn't understand English also. I thought he was understanding English, but he had a weird reaction. His body went weird. I see it in people. Some people are stuck up too, very stuck up. Very stuck up with the state of mind and uh, the cultural uh, cultural programming, your environment. You know, it depends where you're from. Where I don't think it should have an effect on your state of mind, but some do. Some let the uh, cultural programming influence them a lot and that's what they pick up day after day and they don't care they don't they just don't care they don't care about changing the well not too many people care welcome to plain earth where uh, i don't know many i don't know many billions don't care but most people do not care and that's the sad thing that's the sad part because you try to make them see the light you try to they don't see it they don't see it some people will never see it they will never see life on the level it should be set. Always on the default state and very just. But again, can you blame them? Can you can you do anything? No, I cannot do anything. I can only free myself and shine my light. That's all I can do. That's all I can do. Today, today I'm very, very conscious that uh, people don't care people don't care about uh, reality and uh, we're very very much enslaved very much on the slave state 
and oblivious to our slave state and not only that we love the fantasy we love it we love this fantasy life all together we're so uh, accustomed of the lies and deception that we love it we love it we have fallen in love with it we even have married ourselves to it to the fantasy yeah we love it we love that fantasy because we don't seek out out of it no nobody the, the inculcation is so profound so profound that you can pass a whole life here never seeking out of this madness never and that's sad that's sad to see this happening that that uh, i i feel deeply concerned to 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 act on this to act on this because i have all kinds of brothers and sisters that are committing spiritual suicide i'm not talking about shape of the earth or anything i'm not talking about this i'm talking about your life I'm talking about your life and that's what I always been talking here it's not I'm not too much a conspiracy guy and uh, trying to find m making tests and measurements and spending my time uh, finding out the nature of reality I'm seeking reality but not the nature the nature of reality you have it around you that's the nature of reality and ne it never changed for me for 44 years uh, nature always been there the Sun's always been shining uh, there's been the rain, there's been harsh winter, there's been, but that's the nature of reality is what's around us. But we must sense it, we must start sensing it. That's the thing, and sense other people around us, sense their, uh, their, uh, their need for inspiration, but that's not what I want to say. I forgot in the, <laughs> in the midst of talking, I forgot what I want to say. But yeah. I think you deserve it. You deserve something better. I deserve something better than lies and uh, nonsense and being fed with nonsense. I, I, I would love something better in my life for my children and being taught lies in school. But that's all they're getting pretty much is lies and programming. It's a lot the programming is very, very and the competition and put that spirit of competition of comparing themselves to others in school and the whole thing is programming. But at least I make them aware of uh, the whole thing. And at least they can grow. They can start growing uh, with a more enlightened mind than uh, the default state of Babylon. Default state, I'm out of it. I've never been really... I've uh, always been a bit different. Like, oh, I'm a different vibe. I'm a different vibe, that's for sure. Again, I'm not going to tell you everything that I uh, feel, because... Uh... But yeah, I want to say everything that I feel, for sure. I say it pretty much here. I think it's pretty much my mission to say what I feel. Yeah, I always did it. Find it important. Yeah, not to be fake. I'm out. <laughs>